A bag full of clothes. Yes, I need those. <laughs> Nothing like an abandoned shack in the middle of a junkyard to make a girl feel like exploring a new wardrobe. It's time to talk about the elephant in the room. This elephant fucking rules. Frank's outside. I should get going if I'm done changing. the woman we saw with Rachel's dad. Weird. Yo, Frank! It's Chloe. I don't know the secret password, man. Is the password... drugs? Price, get your ass in here. It smells like piss in here. Shut up. You have a rough night or something? Every night's a rough night. I've got a notebook in the back somewhere. Go get it for me, would you? Who is that? Well, ah! God. Jeez, man. Get my notebook, Price. Then we'll talk. No. things for Frank. How low can I go? People leave their info when they damage someone's car? Fight the power. 
This is a nasty one, all right. Big, hard to contain. We don't typically see fires like this on the Oregon coast this time of year. Wait, Perhaps Frank got a puppy? Ah, oh, man. Rachel the therapist would have a field day with this. Shit. The mill burned down. Jeez. That's an expensive dog. Frank must be spending hundreds of dollars on this dog. Don't mind if I do. Don't even fucking think about it. Damn. A swingy, flippy instrument of death. what I think it is. Ugh, shit. I'm in the red. Time to find out what Frank wants to discuss. Because Frank finally gave up on the steak. and Bowser are okay. Is this it? Have a seat. Pompadour, huh? That's one badass name for a dog. It's French. Does it mean, like, tough guy or something? Do I look like I speak fucking French? 
Okay, so who was that woman? What woman? The one I saw coming out of your RV. Oh yeah, I meant to introduce you. Her name is Mind Your Own Fucking Business. Rachel would want to know more. I bet I can convince Frank it's harmless to tell me. Dude, I'm just curious. What's the big deal? Idiot. I make money by being discreet. Frank, you know I hate everyone. Who do you think I'm gonna tell? Come on, Price. I gotta protect my clients. Happy customers are the foundation of a good business. Hey, so... Uh, I had this dream the other night about a cloud that swallowed Arcadia Bay. You too? See? We're a lot alike, Frank. We've got shit in common. Sure, I guess. So why are you so hung up on this chick? Jeez, Frank. So sensitive. You guys got a thing going? Mixing business with pleasure? What? No, I... Forget it, Price. Over my dead body. If you don't tell me who she is, I'm just gonna assume you're dating. Or she's your boss. Or something else embarrassing. So... Are you gonna tell me who that Christ, was? Christ, do you ever shut up? I'm not telling you anything, okay? <sighs> you don't have to be rude about it. Two damn seconds of peace and quiet is all I want. <sighs> okay. Okay. I'm good now. You hear the mill burn down? Yeah. I, uh, heard some stuff about it. Crazy. My friend Damon runs the place. He lost a lot of money last night. Money from what? Well, he's always had a few things going on. I help him out with some of them. Don't drown me in the details, Frank. Lately, he's been doing some stuff that I don't like. But I don't seem to have much leverage with him like I once had. Anyway. You and I have shit to discuss. Is this about the buck 75? What? The money that I owe you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, I, I don't give a shit about that. Wait, do you have it? Give me like another week. I don't have enough right now. I wonder if I'll ever get tired of your crap. You're lucky you're the least of my problems. Open my notebook. Last page. Should be some entries for a kid named Drew. You know him? <laughs> Drew North? Yeah, he's... Oh, holy shit. That's a lot of money. Drew runs Oxy for Damon. Apparently football players eat it like candy. That's smart, I guess. It pays well? Go Bigfoots. Problem is, Drew owes a grant, and he's not answering my calls. You know what's going on with them? No. I never talked to him. Or his type. No one's just a type, Price. Anyway, here's the job. I'm taking you to Blackwell. Go to Drew's room, find the money, and I'll meet you to pick it up. Can you handle that? Yeah, of course, but what's in it for me? Idiot, you still owe me. So, if I do this, then we're good? That, and I'll do even better. I'll give you a 10% cut of the money. Okay. Yeah, sure. I'll do it. What's the matter? It might be a little tough. I, I'm not supposed to be at Blackball. I got expelled this morning. 
Congratulations. Still easier for you to go on canvas than for me. If you can't even do this price... A hundred dollars closer to leaving Arcadia Bay. With a bit of cash and the truck fixed, Rachel and I could really do it. We could leave for good. I'll do it. Good deal. I think I'd be back this soon. Well, here goes nothing. Better hurry up and get into the dorms.